Hi, Richard Walding here. I'm just going to show you what the endpoint looks like using phenylthaline for an acid-base titration. Uh, in the video you can see I've added phenylthaline to the container, that's just a plastic cup. I've got sodium hydroxide in the burette. Now at the endpoint you need a faint pink colour to last for 30 seconds. You can see here it's not lasting very long. Now I'm titrating uh, soda water in the uh, container so it's basically the weak acid carbonic acid uh, it's not quite a distinct endpoint like it would be if it was a strong acid like hydrochloric okay you can see it's staying pink but not quite 30 seconds look it's gone now okay so I add a few more drops of sodium hydroxide from the burette it's gone pink again but you'll notice it only lasts a few seconds so we're not at the end point yet so I've added a little bit more, another drop, and it's lasting maybe five seconds until it goes clear. The pink colour's gone. So I just keep adding sodium hydroxide until I get that faint pink lasting 30 seconds. Okay, we're almost there, but not pink for 30 seconds. So I add a little bit more, and that looks like maybe 10 seconds. It's still faintly pink, but you can see it's faded to almost nothing. Okay, another couple of drops. Maybe this time you can see it's fading away. It's fading because the carbon dioxide is coming out of solution and making the colour disappear. So almost there. I've almost got all of the carbon dioxide titrated. So let's try another drop. And I think this might be it. Okay, it's staying pink. And we just have to watch the stopwatch to make sure it stays pink for 30 seconds. It's still pink. And the pink colour is still there. So I think that's about it. Yep, pink for 30 seconds. That's the end point.